The following video is an ABC primetime investigative report that started the biohacking revolution in 2005. You want to get an edge on turning back the clock with just a few pills? Who doesn't? Well, it's no longer science fiction, but science possibility, a potential breakthrough. As I found out firsthand, there may be a way to erase years, at least inside my body. Granted, it's down the road, but some scientists are wondering if a new pill I took might offer a very long life. It may not look like the fountain of youth, but inside this nondescript building, I'm about to become part of an exciting experiment, a kind of guinea pig. Dr. McCord, okay. I'm here at the University of Colorado in Denver to meet Dr. Joe McCord, a world-renowned scientist. This is a pretty exciting stuff you're finding, huh? It is. We're very excited about it. His latest research could very well unravel the mystery of aging itself. And as decades of experiments may have the potential of adding years to people's lives and possibly prevent chronic diseases like cancer, diabetes, and heart disease. It all centers around this small yellow pill, and for me, it begins with a blood test. Yeah, can we scoot? Yeah, there we go. It wouldn't be the first time I've given blood for this company. <laughs> they want to check my levels of something called T-bars, which is a rough indicator of a person's actual age. T-bars can identify a condition known as oxidative stress, a kind of measure of the wear and tear on our bodies. Oxidative stress, like the rusting of an engine, is not a good thing. Bad for the body. Leading to disease. Leading to disease and leading to malfunction and importantly leading to what we call aging. It is a slow progression of increasing oxidative stress. That's the main characteristic biochemically of the aging process. The problem of aging begins with the very food we eat to give us energy. As our cells burn that food, they also release toxic chemicals. Those chemicals, you may know them as free radicals, react with all the components of our cells, literally bombarding them millions of times per second, damaging all our cells. The result? Oxidative stress. And we all have it. The body fights back with a system of defenses. It makes two antioxidant enzymes, catalase and SOD, whose job is to gobble up the free radicals before they can harm our cells. So, doctor, how often do I take these? And so, here I go. With that swallow, I've just become part of a potentially landmark scientific experiment. Doesn't taste bad. It's called protandum, and tests on both mice and humans have already shown that it revs up the manufacture of those good enzymes in our bodies. More enzymes, fewer free radicals to harm us. Right now, all we know is that this preparation decreases oxidative stress. Oxidative stress is not a disease, just like aging is not in itself a disease, but it's something that accompanies and is attached to, to many disease processes. So you can see the age-related Normally, oxidative stress, measured by those T-bars, increases with age. But in Dr. McCord's tests, taking just one pill of protandum a day reversed that trend for everyone at every age, even for an 80-year-old. They all are reduced to the level of oxidative stress that one would expect, frankly, in a, in a newborn or a very young child. So just what's in this seemingly incredible pill? Well, actually, its roots are very humble. Protandum is a combination of five plant ingredients. Some you may know, green tea or turmeric, a spice used in Indian cooking. Others, withania somnifera and Silibum marianum, are more exotic. There's a huge human experience with each of these ingredients. Uh, they've been used often in traditional medicine in India and China and uh, many other cultures. In some cases, centuries and centuries. And so, ancient Eastern healing and modern Western medicine may soon be working together. High oxidative stress is associated with more than aging. It's been linked to hundreds of illnesses. It's at the very center of many diseases. Liver disease, diabetes, emphysema, asthma, uh, uh, I've studied all of these, strokes, heart attacks. Even mental disease? Yes. Depression? Alzheimer's disease, depression. 
clinical studies to assess protandum in both diabetes and heart disease should start in three to four months. But what about my progress? After nearly two weeks now, it's time to get my results. Dr. McCord calculates the numbers. The result? My level of oxidative stress has declined dramatically. 45%. That's, that's excellent. Just look at where I fall on the graph before and after. Which, if extrapolated back, is, is the level you would see in a newborn baby. But we do know that oxidative stress is part of those disease processes. I don't want to wait until I'm 80 years old and find out that I should have taken it. Protandem is a true scientific breakthrough in anti-aging. Protandem has been reported on ABC, NBC, and PBS, featured in the Wall Street Journal, and described in CNN chief medical correspondent Dr. Sanjay Gupta's book, Dr. Joe McCord has devoted his life's work to the study of free radicals, their role in aging, and the many problems associated with aging. Our bodies are producing hundreds of millions of free radicals at, uh, at any given time. And the notion that we're going to put out that fire or quench that number of free radicals with a single capsule of, for example, vitamin E or vitamin C, uh, really, when you think about it, doesn't make much sense. Rather, the approach is to turn on the genes to make huge numbers of copies of, of antioxidant chemicals in our body, things like catalase and superoxide dismutase and glutathione. Consumers spend billions every year on antioxidants in the form of food and supplements, hoping to reduce these free radicals. But antioxidants from these sources can only eliminate one free radical for every one antioxidant molecule you consume. Protandem is scientifically proven to slow cellular damage caused by free radicals. Taking one protandem one time per day for 30 days turns on these anti-aging enzymes in your body. Your own enzymes eliminate free radicals at a rate of one million to one. We found, as many other scientists had documented, that there is a progressive increase in T-bars in your blood the older you get. When these same people took protandem for 30 days, the age-dependent increase in lipid peroxidation was completely eliminated. After protandem, we could no longer distinguish the 80-year-old from the 20-year-old.